Welcome back to the shoot around. Miami Heat beat the Portland Trail Blazers 107 to 98 and one of the most satisfying wins of the season. They played great. Ariel, knee jerk reaction to this game. Thought the Heat's defense looked really good. Thought Trevor Reza did a phenomenal job on Damian Lillard. And I thought Bam and Jimmy were absolutely all over the place defensively. Their impact was absurd. Yeah, they're going to need another kind of performance like that again tonight. They're playing against the Phoenix Suns, who are, objectively speaking, one of the best teams in the league. They're currently second best in net rating. They're just a really, really good basketball team, and they play well on both ends of the floor. They're really good at shooting, highly efficient team. Um, Chris Paul and Devin Booker leading the way. They're, they're a really good team. But one of my keys to victory for this game is actually to speed the Suns up. They're coming off of a back-to-back. They just played against the Houston Rockets, and – I mean, CP3 is not very young. I believe he is 35 years old. DeAndre Aiden does not want to run up and down the floor. That is pretty much your key to victory. Just speed them up and try to get easy buckets in transition. Try to get DeAndre Aiden moving his feet a lot. And then the paint will start to open up a little bit. But outside of that, it's going to be a really tough game. Ariel, what are your keys to victory against the Suns? I think you make a really good point about speeding them up. I thought the Heat did a very good job of that in the last game, right? They forced 17 turnovers on the Blazers. They had 28 points off of those turnovers. So much of the same recipe. I want to see the defense flying around. I want Jimmy, Bam, Iggy, Ariza, all those guys in the passing lanes, pressure, CP3, pressure, whoever has the ball. They should be tired. So take advantage of that. And also, I like the way that Bam played against drop coverage in the last game against the Blazers. I want to see the same tonight. I want to see him go at DeAndre Ayton. When Ayton's sitting in the paint waiting for Bam to drive, not showing on the pick and rolls, take the jump shot. That mid-range jumper is going to be there all night for Bam. Yeah, 53% from mid-range since the trade deadline over the last nine games. Uh, Bam is turning it on once again, and he looks really, really good, impacting both ends of the floor, same way Jimmy Butler does. Uh, it's It's been fun to watch this team. Six of the last seven, they've won. Ariel, do they get the win tonight against the Suns? I think so. I think the Heat get a win tonight. I I really, really hope so because, I mean, tomorrow night is against the Denver Nuggets in Denver on a back-to-back. It's not the best recipe for success, but we'll see what happens. Hopefully the Heat win in Phoenix.